All right, guys, in this video, I'm going to teach you how to play one of my favorite songs called Topless by Breaking Benjamin. Oh, wow, yeah. Tuning is in drop D flat. Sha -na -na, na -na -na. So here we go. All right, to start off, uh, this song is uh, Breaking Benjamin plays this in drop D flat. And that's what I'm tuned in now, but you can play it in just straight drop D. Um, if you want to play along with Breaking Benjamin, like listening to your iPod and stuff, then you want to be in D flat. So um, to start off, um, these are all going to be power chords, like that, and uh, to start off, uh, the intro goes 0, 2, 0, 2, and then it goes up to 3, and it sounds like this. And that's the intro. They play that twice, and then the high part with the high strings that you could, that you hear are the harmonics on the fifth fret. And a harmonic is when you just barely touch the string; you don't actually push it down to the fret. You just barely touch it, and it's these last three strings right here, and it sounds like this. And it goes four, five, four, six. Okay, and then um, that's the intro, and during the verse, they palm mute the second fret, and then unpalm mute when they go to the third. They never go up and in the verse, it just goes. And then uh, the chorus are octave chords. Put your first finger on the third fret of the second string and your ring finger on the 5th fret of the 4th string. And you're going to want to mute the 3rd string right in between your fingers. And it goes from the 3rd fret here, up to the 5th fret, to the 7th fret, and then it goes 10, 9. You know, it sounds like this. And then it goes back to the... Sorry. I have trouble with the harmonic sometimes too, it takes practice. But uh, that's the verse, the intro, and the chorus. And then when they go to the solo, it starts on the third string, and it goes two, four, five, four, two, four, and then it moves up to the fourth string, and then it goes five, four. And it looks like this. Then you pluck each string twice. And you're going to do that same exact formation, except you're going to start up here on the 14th fret. And the lead guitar holds that note while the rhythm guitar goes back to the chorus. And that's pretty much all the parts of the songs. Um, the song actually ends like this. That's how it ends. And uh, that's all the parts of the song. You can piece them together. Um, yeah, it just goes verse, chorus, verse, chorus, solo, and then chorus, and then the little outro, which I just showed you. So, yeah, that's it. All right, so thanks for watching my video. Mm. Oh yeah. If you have a song that you want to learn how to play, um, just go ahead and leave me a comment down below or send me a message and I will record a tutorial just for you. Also, it'd be awesome if you guys could go check out my other channel right here. We do uh, short films and such and such. Alright, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next Friday.